Previously, we examined relativistic addition of velocities, also known as Lorentz velocity transformations. Now, let's actually examine how we can apply those concepts by looking at the following example. So, a spaceship takes off Earth and travels with a velocity of 0.7 c along the x-axis, where c is the speed of light constant in a vacuum. Now, the spaceship then releases a missile straight ahead that moves with a velocity of 0.8 c with respect to that spaceship. We want to calculate the velocity of that missile with with respect to the Earth. So basically, we have two different reference frames. So the Earth is the stationary inertial, inertial reference frame. It has the X, Y, and Z axis. And the spaceship itself is its own inertial reference frame that is given by axes X prime, Y prime, and Z prime. And the spaceship is moving to the right with a velocity of 0.7 C. So that means this reference frame is moving to the right away from the Earth with the same velocity as the velocity of that spaceship. Now, the spaceship basically releases a missile and that missile travels with a velocity of 0.8 c. So this is given by u prime x. The prime means we're dealing with the spaceship's frame of reference and the x means the missile is traveling in the positive direction along the x-axis. So basically, this is the velocity of the missile with respect to the spaceship's reference frame. We want to find the velocity of the missile with respect to the stationary frame, the Earth's frame. So basically, we want to apply the equation that we discussed in the previous lecture known as the Lorentz velocity transformation. So this is the equation that we were able to derive. So ux, the velocity of the missile with respect to the Earth's frame, is equal to u prime x plus v divided by 1 plus u prime x times v divided by c squared, where c is the speed of light in a vacuum, v is the velocity of the frame, so the velocity of our spaceship, and u prime x is the velocity of that missile with respect to the spaceship's reference frame. So this quantity is 0.8 c and the velocity of the spaceship, the frame, is 0.7 c. So we add these two and we get 1.5 c. Now let's calculate the bottom. We have 1 plus 0.7 c multiplied by 0.8 c divided by c squared. So c multiplied by c gives us a c squared. The c squareds will cancel and 0.7 multiplied by 0.8 gives us 0.56. So 1 plus 0.56 gives us 1.56. So finally, the velocity of our missile with respect to the stationary frame, our Earth, is equal to 1.5 c divided by 1.56 and that is about 0.96 c. So that means this speed of the missile relative to the stationary Earth is about 96% of the speed of light in a vacuum.